Hi, I'm Genevieve Frederick, founder of Pets of the Homeless. I'd like to welcome you and thank you. Volunteers like you are the backbone of any nonprofit, and we appreciate that you chose Pets of the Homeless. So let's get started. As a volunteer recruiter, we are asking you to contact your own veterinary hospital, groomer, pet food retail store, or any other business that you go to on a regular basis. The reason is that you know them, hopefully they know you, and you've given them your business. With that in mind, it will not be hard to ask if they would like to help feeding pets of the homeless by becoming a donation site. By now, you should have received materials that included a flyer to leave with a business, rack cards, a reporting form, cards to give to homeless people, and some envelopes. If you haven't received anything in the mail, let us know. Businesses want to know what's in it for me. So use the flyer that we included because it lists all the benefits of joining. Before heading out or calling, it would be helpful for you to understand our impact. So please read our website, especially the page Help Us, where you will find our impact information that is updated monthly. While you're on our home page, type in your city and search icon to see what businesses have already joined and if there is a food bank that the new donation site will be able to use. Many times the food bank can pick up food. Should there not be a web of, should there not be a food bank on the website, we ask that you start calling a few in the area and ask them if they distribute pet food to their clients. And if not, would they if they received donated pet food? Do this step before you call upon a potential donation site. You can tell a potential donation site that you are a volunteer with Pets of the Homeless and will help them get established with a food bank that will distribute the donated pet food. Let them know that at headquarters, we'll be sending out a press release to local media announcing that their business is a donation site. It would be helpful if you could email us the names and links of local newspapers in your community. Once you get a commitment from the owner or manager, have them sign up on the website under donation sites. Follow up in a few days and ask if they signed up or if they have any questions. We're always available to answer all your questions. And please join your local Pets of the Homeless Facebook group so you can communicate with like-minded volunteers in your area. Again, thanks for your time and support to help us meet our mission. Stay tuned for more informational Pets of the Homeless videos in the future. Bye now.